Hey, what are you guys doing today? And welcome back to another episode. Yeah, I think I'm getting better. <laughs> so, we just finished the last mission where we took out the raiders, and now we have to do this. And my map is gone somewhere. There it is. Sorry about that, I just didn't know where to go. So, let's keep going. So, yeah, the last mission we took out raiders took me a few efforts, annoying as hell, but I got it done, nonetheless. I you know that settlement out. you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. Not much use yet, but once we have more allies, That's pretty cool. You'll have help whenever you need it. So... There's something I need to ask you. I don't think I ever told you what happened to the Minute Man. How I ended up as the last one. Are you really the last Minute Man? Maybe not literally. There must be a lot of former Minute Man out there who gave it up in disgust after the Quincy Massacre. But we were the last active group of Minute Men. And now, well, it's just me. As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up, but I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds, but that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And I think you've got it in you to be that leader. Mr. Garvey is quite right, sir. If anyone can unite the people, it's you. Yeah, why me? What makes you think I can do this? Well, I guess I have to do some mission in the game. There wasn't anything in it for you. You had your own problems to deal with, but you did it anyway. That kind of selflessness has been in mighty short supply around here for quite a while. Okay, I'll do it. That's the spirit, sir, and one giant step in the right direction for the Commonwealth. Good, good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Minutemen and the Commonwealth too. Don't worry, I'll be right beside you all the way, General. It is quite a promotion. That's quite a promotion you just gave me. The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of general. Our last leader was General well. Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last Minuteman is, there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. I've got something a bit different for you. These awkward silences. Our scouts have found a promising spot for a new settlement. The trouble is that some kind of vicious beasts are lairing there. Once you clear it out, set up a radio beacon to let settlers know about it. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth, one piece at a time. Well, that's pretty cool. Now we're general of the Minutemen. Which means we're the leaders, so pretty awesome. Alright, so um let's see what we can do now. Um We have this oh where's the mission? Um Quests We I think that's the one we're doing right now. Jelani is the first step. Yeah, I think that's the main story, I'm not too sure. Or is that it? That's it, I think. Yeah, go to Diamond City. We've done that. Alright, so... We have to talk to Sturgis. Which I think we did. 
but we obviously haven't because we haven't completed it yet. Oh yeah, we just keep on going. Um, hold on, look at the map again. I want to go to Diamond City and try to get stuck in Diamond City done, so we're just going to head there right now. Keeps telling me I need to go out there, but just hang on a minute. I want to try to find out something. Can we talk to people Uncle here? Wilson, what have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a sin. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family. Um. Gun down now. He's a Sith! He'll kill us all! Oh! No! My god! Okay. So he just would take everything he owns. Hear me? Just you folks in your damn paranoia. Oh my god. Well. That's a nice way to start. I still don't know what to do. I went to Diamond City. Hold on. Oh, do we go up here? I've seen this little lift here and I didn't know you could use it, but... Yeah. I'm probably going to be wrong. Excuse me. <sighs> Mayor's in no mood to talk about any of this synth nonsense. Unless you're looking for a housing permit, I can't help you. W wait, what was that about synths? Oh no, I'm not saying anything. I like my job, thank you very much. Well, let's hear about the permit. We have one home available. It's in the center of town, right near the market. You can do whatever you like with the interior, and all the tools you need to make your own furnishings are provided. Oh, it just no seems pointless. Buy house for two. Um, not interested. Okay. <laughs> too rich for your blood? Can't blame you. Sassy bitch. Um, I want to try. Oh, I have a feeling this is not going to be the right way. Hello, Cotard. Oh my god, come on. <laughs> Some back to the future show right here, look at this. You're one handsome butler, Cotard. I uh, like you. Oh my god, can you just. not leave did I break the game that was the longest elevator journey so you're that I've ever experienced in my life he's telling me why to go down here all the time do I talk to this guy no I don't is there someone up here I need to talk to? I'm lost. Oh, I don't know what to do. I'm just going to transition until I find out. i catch you guys in a minute. 
Who would I talk to about finding a missing person? You're in bad luck. No one tries to find missing people in Diamond City. Missing people means the Institute is involved. And no one's going to want to get the Institute's attention. You're a smart kid. Isn't there someone in town who isn't afraid of this Institute? Well, there is the detective, Mr. Nick Valentine. He's not afraid of anything. If anyone's gonna help you, it's him. Thanks. You were a big help. Remember, the Institute's out there, newcomer. Watch your back. Alright guys, I transitioned to this moment right here. I found out... I think where to go. I had to find a guy called Nick... Valentine. And he's in Diamond City. And I don't know if he's in here or if he's out there. Where is Nick Valentine? I'm just gonna talk. Or... No, you're... Newcomer, huh? Talk to Evan at the wall. Detective. Does anyone fight back? Resident. Resident. Oh my god. Could this be him? Oh my god, I swear to god, it's that simple and I'm gonna cry. Oh, sorry. No, it was not Nick Valentine. The pills. Huh. Um. Oh, call to her to move. The photograph. Oh, I'm just gonna talk to her because she might know something. He never did photograph well. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You don't get it. The detective, he's gone. Missing. Don't worry, I can help. Tell me what happened. <sighs> Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Um, I'm just gonna offer help. It's gonna you. be a mission anyway. Have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please hurry. All right, so. We found the mission and we leveled up. Um, we level up quickly right now. Um, actually, I want to do punch and attacks. I don't know if they're going to be important in the game or not, so I'm just going to. these three and I'm gonna start working on these three here so we're gonna put intelligence on one we do agility next and look I'll probably keep luck on three and then just pair these two up to about five and then I'll probably leave them there and work on these for the rest of the way and then do these as well so let's keep going and find Mr. Valentine Detective Valentine Alright guys, sorry for that transition, we found out how to find him, he's in the combat zone, he's there realistically, so we're going to make our way down the combat zone, so let's get going, and we go this way. See those big lights? I don't care. <laughs> so yeah, we're out in the open now, so I have our guard up. Gonna make our way down to Nick Valentine and find him, hopefully. That's so annoying. All I needed to do was go into the mission board and click onto the mission. I hear gunfire. And don't know 
Oh, wrong button. Okay, they're against us, right. No, I can't. I'm just gonna go close. Headshot. Hit. Oh my god, I'm so weak. Why ain't you not dying? Oh my god. I'm so bad at this game. Why aren't you dying? Here we go. Oh, don't die now. Oh, please. Thank you, God. Take everything you own. Oh my God. Impact knuckles. We're not going to take everything you own. We're getting a lot of stuff lately. I think I need to start upgrading weapons because my weapons seem to be very weak lately. Um, what do you have? Bottle caps to we'll take. We'll take, we'll take. A pipe pistol, Jeff. I think I took your ammo. And there's one more person down here. Is there not? Oh, there's a raider actually. And I want to get a headshot. It's gone. Okay. Now I'm going to die if I'm not careful. That was too close. Um. Okay, shit. Cause you're going to help me at all here. weapons because that is shocking. Uh, <laughs> oh, where did I come from again? Oh my god, no, do not die now. Oh my god, please tell me you're better at least. Pistol is so much better. No, nothing there that I'm interested in. We're just going to keep going. Um, guys, I might leave it here and upload another episode very quickly. Hold on. Take that. Oh my god. <laughs> um, can we take what you have? Iguana bits. I think that's food to eat. We'll take... Oh, we'll just take everything. Why not? So yeah, guys, I'll end it there. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.